Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Tool Talk. Um, this is just going to be a quicker one, and this is just basically um, a rundown of my absolute favourite spider that I own and why I love it so much. Um, I know this sounds odd, like I don't tell the other wrenches I've got favourites, but I do, and this is my favourite. Um, so this is one I actually got this um, off of a tool truck that was just happened to be at a garage I was um, I was going to for to well, actually a scrap yard to get some parts. And uh, I saw this one, I couldn't resist it. So this is a, uh, a little Trident unit. This is a 10, 11 mil um, aviation spanner. As you can see by the length of it, it's extremely long. And having a long 10 mil when you're working on Japanese stuff really, really pays dividend. Um, it's a the, this. It wasn't particularly cheap. It was about 12 quid, which is the most I've ever spent on a single spanner. Obviously, I'm a DIYer. I don't tend to buy off the. I don't tend to buy off tool trucks. So it's that wasn't really a thing for me, but. I just couldn't resist it, and what what I really love about these spanners is just how long they are. This is a fantastic length. Like there's a my finger for scale, so it's a really big, big unit, and it's got very very nice clearances. You see, this is the 11 millimeter side on the unit. She's got a nice, tight clearance on it. It's the head's not enormous like you get on some of these cheaper ones like you get a head like that and it's rubbish and then obviously the fact that this is a 10 millimeter and it's this long is just absolutely fantastic and it's great for using loads and loads of leverage in really tight spaces like for example um, exhaust manifold bolts um, on some vehicles they are 10 millimeter and they can be a real ball ache to do with a ratchet or anything like that these help tremendously because they can sit flush and you still have enough leverage to crack them off which you wouldn't have with a normal spanner so i strongly recommend getting a couple of these definitely um even a set if you could um because like i say having loads of leverage is fantastic i mean even in this small one but for the big ones like the 1719s you know cracking off suspension bolts that kind of thing you really really can't go wrong with a unit you know it's just it's a fantastic fantastic piece of kit um, they look cool as well, and they're lovely and weighted. They've got a really nice heft to them. You, um, yeah, I really can't say enough about one of these spanners. And like I say, if you, if you have the um, opportunity to get a set, I highly suggest picking it up. 